So Baked by Melissa, who is my favorite cupcake company in the entire universe, sent me a planner. Isn't it cute? And it's in my favorite colors, which is like that bright pink. I think you can see it behind me. I have other bright pink stuff. Um, I really just love this color. Anyways, they don't make planners. They make cupcakes, but they sent this to me anyway. Um, so I'm gonna tell you the story behind that and we're gonna take a look inside because it's actually very well done. Hi everyone, I'm Lisa from Pretty Fabulous and I help online businesses create beautiful digital downloads using Adobe InDesign. So if this sounds like you or something you might be interested in, make sure to hit the subscribe button below. I post new videos every Monday and Thursday and I do unboxings on Saturdays. So this is the cutest planner. It has gold foil on it. And again, it's from a company that makes cupcakes and they sent it out as a thank you. So let's just go back. So for Val so every single holiday, my boyfriend spends all his holidays with his mother. Um, that's his best friend. That's who he likes to hang out with for the holidays. And so I do get a little sad when I'm left alone. So I was like, you know what, for Valentine's Day, I'm going to order myself a box of cupcakes. And so I got myself a box of cupcakes, which is like 50 cupcakes, probably too much. And if you watch my monthly plan with me, you know that I really shouldn't be eating sugar. Like I should be not eating sugar at all. I'm not supposed to, but I do eat sugar sometimes. So, and I try to only make it for like things I really love, which are like my Baked by Melissa cupcakes. So those cupcakes are pretty expensive because they're flown in from New York. They have to be refrigerated. So I think it's like 60 or $70 to get 50 cupcakes flown in, which I know you're like a dollar cupcake, but they're those tiny little itty bitty mini cupcakes, but they're so worth it. Um, anyways, they just don't have any Baked by Melissa's here in California. I think they have. Yeah, they just don't. <laughs> They're only in New York and a couple different places over on the East Coast. But anyways, totally unexpected. A few weeks later, they sent me this planner and they said, we would just wanted to send this to you as a thank you um, for being such a great customer during this time. Because I think maybe sales are probably lower. I would imagine uh, most people don't have expendable income to buy $70 worth of cupcakes to fly across the country. I mean, not that I have all that expendable income, but like, you know, my dollars, I spend them were like the things that bring me the most value. And that would be my favorite cupcakes in the world. So anyways, let's take a look at this planner because it's so well done. I was so surprised. I was expecting not something janky, but I was expecting somewhere, something where they're like, okay, we're just going to give out planners for free. Just as like a thank you. Like, so when you go to the Hallmark store, in fact, I don't think there are that many left. They'll give you like a little calendar and it's like, something you put in your pocket and it's okay and it's cute and it's tiny. Um, but, or if you get a free planner, it's like something that's really generic or like very, very nice. So let's look inside. I totally thought these were cupcakes when I saw this in the mail, but it was not cupcakes. It was a planner, which is kind of surprising because I didn't know that Baked by Melissa makes planners or anything like that. So, um, go. Ta-da! It's so cute, right? And it's in their colors, so let's measure it because I have no idea. So it is like six inches wide by eight and a half inches tall. So let's go ahead. It is an oak coil. It has, it looks like a chipboard for a front. Let's look like platinum. I guess they're platinum that dark copper. Um, so it has some nice gold foiling over here and you get an elastic strap band. So let's go ahead and look inside. So this is so cute. The incredible blah, I guess that would be me. Lisa is the owner of this planner and it has this pretty illustration. We have 2021 and then we have 2022. We have a birthday chart. It's actually a really good idea. Um, so you can see everything at a glance. And then each month, oh, I got a little afraid. Um, but each month has its own little illustration. So it's almost like, it looks like it's for kids, um, which I guess it could be. But I think it's still really cute. I really like illustrations. So if you don't, this might not be for you. Um, and mostly I'm just fascinated because I am unable to illustrate. I have no artistic abilities in that sense. So um, those were each of the months. Okay, so let's look at each month. I bet it's a rinse and repeat. Uh, so in here we have a two-page monthly spread. And part of the month is on this harder cardstock tab divider. 
And then you have last month and the next month up here at the top, you have your holidays and oh, Aquarius season. I actually don't even know what that means. Um, some room over here on the right to do some writing. And we have a horizontal layout over here and then a notes page over here. So this is pretty simple. So it's a rinse and repeat. I do like that it starts on Monday and goes to Sunday and it repeats those holidays. Um, oh, this is nice. So it does in that the week that you're in, it's a different color. These are actually my brand colors. Well, my new brand colors. So um, I guess that's a little bit tealish instead of bluish, but yeah, I think this is super cute and it looks like it has a different illustration for each month that kind of matches the theme. So this is mushrooms. You have a little mushroom over here to the right for April. You have a little rainbow for May. You have that, I guess, a flower thing. I don't know what it is. <laughs> but for June, it looks like you get a little water rock formation thing. For July, you got the plants. August, you get the sunflower. September, let me see. September, you get the clouds and... I don't know that it's that cold in September. I don't know. In California, it is like still summertime, 90 degrees. Um, October, we have pumpkins. And for November, the corner illustration is some stars. And for December, it is mountains. So, and then at the end, it looks like they give you just a couple blank pages. So, actually, I lie. That's actually, that's a, that's a lot of blank pages. And I know what this is, BB must be like a quality check thing. Um, but this is super cute, totally unexpected. And I absolutely loved it. All right, what did you think? Was this the best planner ever? And also the thing is, if you wanted to give these out as a thank you to customers, that's a great idea. Or as an add-on when they're checking out. I know what you're thinking. If I sell cupcakes, why would I sell a planner? Why wouldn't you sell a planner? You could sell a planner for everything. You're buying a car. Hey, did you want a free planner to go with that has like our design and our insignia? Everybody loves getting things that are branded. Um, and you know, you probably spend a lot of time and money and effort on your logo. Why not slap it onto a planner? So a lot of people are doing that drop shipping where they're trying to do mugs and t-shirts. Not everybody wants mugs and t-shirts. I know I don't. I would rather have a planner. So, you know, just something to think about. And if you would like to create your own planner, make sure to sign up for my free five-day course, Planner 101. I will leave a link to it below. And I hope everyone's having a great day and you're able to eat lots of cupcakes. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Bye.